the summer solstice has come and gone. Just like the Edmonton Oilers chance to bring home a cup to Canada. Well, as farmers always say, there's always next year. Great job, Edmonton. Great effort. There's always next year. But I'm afraid on the farm, this canola plant is beginning to fall flat, just like Connor McDavid did at center ice with 10 seconds left as he watched the Florida Panthers win the cup. So, what does that have to do with soybeans, you ask? Well, the summer solstice has came and gone, and we did not start our flowering process before that, in the longest days of the year. And I don't need to tell you why, we're approximately 90% of normal heat units. However, what I do wanna share with you, and what I wanna leave you with, with what we're seeing on our farm, and you're seeing in your bean crop, is that's okay. They are still going to mature in time. Why? Daylight sensitivity. Daylight sensitivity is going to be telling these plants right now, as we speak, that it's time to flower, days are getting shorter. So we're still gonna reach maturity. Don't worry about frost, we're gonna get there. So that's the saving grace. Number two thing I wanna share with you about soybeans is how late can I spray my soybeans? Number one question we've been getting this week at Petura Seeds, and the answer is you can spray your soybeans while they are flowering. What I like to see is you out there before pod set starts. So if your rows aren't closed, just like we have time, spray them later in the season into July. Make sure you're spraying them when it's cooler rather than hot out so that uh, you're not damaging the flowers too much. And remember when I'm saying spray, you're spraying with water, okay? Don't worry about weed control. We'll make sure those soybeans are clean. And if you're questioning, it's gonna be, you have some time yet. We're gonna be doing on the farm as we finished our first app, and we'll be waiting for a second app a little bit later. So thanks for tuning in to this week's final episode of what we're seeing, what we're doing, and what we're learning. Till next time, keep your beans clean. And as Paul Marie said last night, the Winnipeg Jets, it's happening next year. Thanks, Paul.